All right, you guys, today we're going to take a look how to make this Garangi halftone effect here in Photoshop. I chose this model as a reference. I'm going to leave a link in the description so you can download it. This is the image size. Let's go to the layer, right click, convert to smart object, and we're going to go to the filter, pixelate, and select color halftone. I'm going to set it to 8, click OK. And this is how it looks. You can also increase or decrease the halftone by going here to the filter, double click on, and this way you can add more if you want. Click OK is gonna make the half tone bigger. I'm gonna leave it like this. Now let's go to the channels. I'm gonna select the green, press Ctrl A, Ctrl C to copy it, press Ctrl D to deselect, and I'm gonna activate the RGB again, go back to the layer. Now let's go and create a new layer, press Ctrl V, and I'm gonna go to the first layer and uncheck the color half tone effect. Now let's select the top layer, go to the blend mode, select overlay. I'm gonna create a duplicate of this, press Ctrl J, and here I'm going to decrease the opacity somewhere around 50% to add more contrast. And I'm going to duplicate the very first layer. I'm going to press Ctrl J and I'm going to bring it all the way up. I'm going to activate the halftone filter here. And let's go to the blend mode and change it to divide. Look at that. And I'm going to decrease it somewhere around 50%. Let's go to adjustments. I'm going to go with the curves and I'm going to bring it up to make it more gray and check that out and up at least we're going to create some noise press and hold alt let's go to the new layer click on it and it's going to pop up this window rename it as noise let's change the blend mode to overlay make sure to check the fill click ok right click on the noise convert to smart object and we're going to go to the filter noise add noise and here you can bump it up all the way and it won't even affect the image that much so i'm going to go with 400 click ok and this is how you make this grungy halftone effect here in Photoshop. Thanks for watching.